Clavio versus Sendlin. Now, this video is going to be a quick comparison. I'm going to show you basically everything that you need to know about these two email marketing tools, including what the differences are, what they are good for, the pricing, and overall, which of these tools is better for your business. If you are interested in potentially picking up one of these tools for yourself, then keep watching as this is going to be the most valuable video you ever watch. Okay, so the first thing that I will say about both of these tools is they actually both offer SMS marketing. Now, I would not say that this is a rarity for an email marketing software to offer this, certainly not anymore. Uh, however, it is still uncommon. So, yeah. What, what you can do is you can basically set up SMS messages on either of these tools and they have such a high open rate. I think I saw something the other day like a text message or an SMS has like a 96% open rate. Which I mean it makes sense. If you get- Whoop, dropped my phone. <laughs> if you get a text message right now, you're probably gonna check it. If you got an email, you probably wouldn't even know about it until two hours later. So they are fantastic. Now with that being said, they are not ridiculously expensive, but they are more expensive than emails, I'll say that. So that is the first thing. Both of these, plus side for both of these, is that they both offer SMS. Now, the next thing I will say is that Clavio is a bigger company. Like, let me show you. So if we go over to Capterra, and we go for, first of all, Clavio. Now, I've got to say, Clavio do make the companies look a lot smaller than they are, because not many people leave reviews. But like, 300 is a pretty good sized company. Now, if we compare this to Sendlin, 32 reviews. So, you can see that Clavio is a lot bigger. Now, that doesn't mean that Sendlin is bad. It's just a lot newer of a company. And that is the second thing I will say. Now, in terms of the platforms, you know what? They are very good. I, I always, when I compare other email marketing softwares, I'm always like, just Cl Clavio is better. Through and through, Clavio is better. It's better, it's better, it's better. With Sendlin... It's pretty tricky. They are both phenomenal software. Like, they're both very, very easy to use. They both look fantastic, which is what I really look for in an email marketing software. And all of the tools are very similar. They make it very easy to create emails. So what you would do is you would just choose from a template like this, take it into a drag and drop tool, as it says, drag and drop functionality. And what you would do is you would like drag in text, edit things, and basically fit the email to how you would want it to look. So it's pretty tricky to like say that one is especially better than the other. If I was pushed for an answer, I would probably say Clavio. It's just got a little bit more class. Sendlin, I think it could be as good in, in a, maybe a year or two, but it just needs a few updates. Like Clavio, you can tell it's, it's rigid, it's been out for years, and you can tell that it's one of the biggest players in the email marketing game. Now, the pricing. And this is what is going to turn you, I think, especially sour to Sendlin is that it's very, very, very expensive. And I don't understand how they get this pricing. Uh, let, let me show you what I mean. So, well, first of all, you can try Sendlane out for 14 days for free. As it says here, 14 day test drive, all the pro level features. So that is very cool. However, on Clavio, <laughs> the free trial sucks. You can see here we get the free trial. You can have zero to 250 contacts. 500 emails per month and 150 free SMS. It's not very good. So Sendlin definitely wins on the free trial. However, when we go to the actual pricing, so for Clavio, I'll talk about the SMS later, but for just email, 5,000 contacts is $100. Same on Sendlin. So 5,000 contacts is $100. Now this looks fine so far. And this I agree with, it's a pretty good price. It's as soon as you go past this point of 5,000 subscribers, makes zero sense. So with Clavio, if we go up to 10,000 subscribers, this makes sense, right? The first 5,000 subscribers you pay for is $100. You want another 5,000 subscribers, it kind of comes as like a discount. Now it's only $150. Sendlin, 5,000 to 10,000 subscribers, they charge $150 just for the second 5,000 subscribers. So <laughs> it's now, Clavio is $150 for 10,000, whereas Sendlane is 275. So that is very, very annoying to do with Sendlane. Now, in terms of the SMS, um, once again, pretty expensive on Sendlane. So if we want 50,000 credits for the SMS, you would be paying $875 for these 50,000 credits uh, on Sendlane compared to 800. Like even for the SMS, it's way more expensive on Sendlane. So that is what I will say. Out of these two tools, 
it is an absolute no-brainer. I would 100% go with Clavio, and that is what I would recommend for you as well. It's just not worth the extra pricing for Sendlane, when Clavio is just as good, if not a little bit better. Plus, it is so much cheaper. So, that is Clavio versus Sendlane. Now, if you learned something from this video, or if you found it valuable in some way, don't forget to smash that like button and tap that subscribe button. And until next time, take it easy.